Hey everyone, Holly here. I'm going to show you a really quick and easy method of how to add a curly wire to something. So I've already drawn out my curve and where I want this wire to go. I'm going to go to create polygon primitive helix with the helix still selected. Shift select my curve. Make sure I'm in the animation drop down menu. Go to deform and choose curve warp. This has now attached my helix to the curve and so now we can use the helix um, creation parameters um, to edit things like how many coils so first thing I'm going to do is change the height I'm going to stretch this so that it follows all the way along the curve I'm going to up the number of coils and then we're going to start to do things like change the width um, and the radius and very quickly you can see we have a curly wire and you can always come back in and tweak these to change the look so for example I might reduce the width down a little bit so it's a bit thinner and I might reduce the number of coils okay I'm also going to just drop the subdivisions down because we don't need uh, that many and then we can smooth it and get a really nice smoothed wire Another great thing about this method, apart from the fact you can come in and edit the coil at a later date, is that it's also linked to the curve. So we can come in, select our curve, go to control vertex, and we can do things like adjust the curve and the coil is going to go with it. So we can just adjust this a bit down so that it sits nicely on our table. And that's it. Simple.